Welcome to the NBC24 Academic Challenge. Here's your host, Norm Bennett. Hey, welcome in everyone to tonight's Academic Challenge. We thank you so much for being with us here tonight. Our two teams in competition, the team to my right from Toledo Central Catholic, we welcome them, and the team to my left from Toledo Christian, we welcome them in as well. Now, before we get started with our first round of play, we're going to read to you at home the rules as to how we're going to play round number one. In our buzz-in round, teams can buzz in when they think they know the answer. Each team will be awarded 10 points for every correct answer. If a team answers incorrectly, they will be deducted 10 points. All right, so now you at home know how to play, so we invite you to play along with us, see if you can keep up with these uh, bright minds out here tonight. So we'll get started. Three minutes on the clock. That clock will begin as I read this first question. Buzz in if you think you know it. The Ashanti people are native of which continent? Central Catholic. Africa. Africa is a correct answer. Because it had no native mammals, it evolved strange birds that filled normally mammalian ecological niches. Name this nation once home to the giant moas and still home to the kiwis. Toledo Christian. New Zealand. New Zealand is the correct answer. What is the English translation of the title of Thomas Mann's 1912 novella, Der Tod in Venedig? Neither team with a try looking for death in Venice would be the correct answer. What, which of these is not a part of the human brain? The cerebellum, the hypothalamus, the temporal lobe, the peritoneum, or the medulla oblongata? Central Catholic. And that is the correct answer. I'll skip pronouncing it again. Here we go on the next one. Name one of the deserts through which the Orange River flows. Central Catholic. Sahara. Sahara would be incorrect. We're looking for the Kalahari or the Namib would be the other one. Here we go. Next one. Jack London wrote this account while in what city? Quote, there stood the tottering walls of the examiner building, the gutted dynamited palace hotel, and the smoldering ruins of the grand hotel. The St. Francis was flaming heavenward. Which city was he talking about? Neither with a try. We're looking for San Francisco would have been the correct answer. The combined armies of Austria and what other country were soundly defeated by French troops under Napoleon at the Battle of Austerlitz? Uh, Central Catholic. Austria and Hungary. Hungary would be an incorrect answer. We were looking for Russia would be the correct answer. Next one. Identify Shakespeare's three-word completely illiterate play title. Alliterative play title, Shakespeare, three words. Neither with a try. We were looking for Love's Labor's Lost would have been a correct answer. Four sports were invented by the YMCA. Name any two of them. Uh, Toledo Christian. Basketball and uh, hockey. Basketball, hockey would be incorrect. Looking for basketball, racquetball, volleyball, or softball, all invented by the YMCA. Next one. Like other male bovines, adult male yaks are called what? Central Catholic. Bulls. Bulls is the correct answer. Usually considered, oh, not enough time for the next question. Ooh, a tough round there. Central Catholic up with 10 points. Toledo Christian with zero on the board right now, but hey, that's okay. We've got a lot of game to play, and we're going to do that right after a quick break. So stay with us. Luke Allen, senior. Daniel Trees, senior. Amanda Sargent, senior. Jacob Dumas, freshman. Callie Bremer, freshman. My name is Josh Graham, and I'm a senior. I'm Matthew Brumbaugh, and I'm a senior. I'm Martha Werner, and I'm a senior. 
In our volleyball round, the low point total team goes first. 10 points will be awarded for every question answered correctly. If a team answers incorrectly, the opposing team gets a chance to steal the question. And if they are correct, they get the following question. Questions will bounce back and forth until the round is complete. All right, we've had the opportunity to meet our players. We also now know the rules for our volleyball round. So if you were paying attention, you know that Toledo Christian will be going first here as we start our volleyball round. So we have three minutes on the clock. Toledo Christian, this question is for you. Usually considered simply as point electric charges, though these atomic particles sometimes appear to behave like hard spheres or as if they were waves. What are they? Electrons. Electrons is the correct answer. Central Catholic for you. During the colonial period, France restricted her settlers in the New World to those who were members of what religion? Catholic Church. Catholic Church. Roman Catholic would be correct. Toledo Christian for you. What did Joe Garagiola mean when he said, mean to say when he remarked, quote, oh well, half of one, six dozen of the other? Well, 50 50 shot. And that is incorrect. Central Catholic, a try? The phrase we're looking for is six of one half dozen of the other, not six dozen of the other. Central Catholic, we stay with you. Of the six New England states, which three share a common border with New York? Uh, Connecticut, New Hampshire. Shit. No, Connecticut, Vermont. Massachusetts. Connecticut, Vermont, Massachusetts is the correct answer. Toledo Christian, this one for you. On the great seal of the United States, what does the combination of olive branches and arrows symbolize? Time up on that one. Central Catholic a try? Peace and war. Peace and war is the correct answer, and we stay with Central Catholic. The science fiction stories of this French author were called, quote, dreams come true. So prophetic was his description of a periscope that a few years later, the actual inventor of the instrument was refused permission for an original patent. Name this author of 20,000 leagues under the sea. Jules Verne. Jules Verne is correct. Toledo Christian, for you, name the first and most important novel written by Jack Kerouac one of the leading writers of the beat movement. Time up for them. Central Catholic a try? No. No try from them. On the road was Kerouac's first one, and we stay with Central Catholic. What Manhattan University is part of the Ivy League? Columbia is correct. Toledo Christian for you. Which insects use the substance propolis to glue together their home, homes? Spiders. Spiders incorrect. Central Catholic a try? Uh, bees. Bees is the correct answer, and we stay with Central Catholic. Time is up on that round. Not enough time for the next question. So we've got two rounds down, two rounds to go. It means we're at halftime here in our academic challenge. We take a quick break, and when we come back, we're going to play our lightning rounds. So stay with us. Welcome back to NBC 24's Academic Challenge. In our lightning round, the low point total team gets to go first and will be awarded 10 points for every correct answer. There are zero deductions for incorrect answers, so guessing is encouraged. Each team can pass on a question, but will have to wait for it to be read in its entirety. Each team has three minutes to get in as many questions as they can in our lightning round. Well, hey, welcome back, everyone. I'm Norm Van Ness here from NBC24. We thank you so much again for being such great supporters of our academic challenge. We now move into our lightning rounds. And per the rules that you saw there right before, right after we came back from the break, you know that Toledo Christian will be going first. We've got three minutes set up on the clock for them. And your three-minute clock will begin as I read your first question. 
Which king was the subject of the movie The King's Speech? Pass. Pass. Looking for King George VI. Gone with the Wind is mostly set in what state? Minnesota. That is incorrect. Looking for Georgia. Next question. What sport is played on horseback with mallets? Polo. Polo is correct. In the gospel, according to Luke, who sent out a decree that all the world should be taxed? Julius Caesar. Uh, Caesar which, which Caesar? Specific Caesar. Caesar Augustus. Augustus is the correct one. We move to the next question. What color is at the other end of the of from violet in the spectrum? Red. Red is correct. What is the positive geometric mean between one and ten thousand? Pass. Pass. Looking for one hundred. Which Holbein painting of a diplomatic duo has a green curtain in the background? Pass. Pass. Looking for the ambassadors. What is Ankongwa's superlative? Pass. Pass. Looking for highest mountain in uh, South America. That's what that one is. Next question. What was lost for the want of a shoe? Pass. A horse would be the correct answer there. Who is credited as the first European to view the Pacific from the Americas? Christopher Columbus. Columbus incorrect. We were looking for Balboa would have been a correct answer. What Axis leaders met in 1939 to form the Pact of Steel? Okay. One foot, one the others. Mussolini and then... Hitler, Mussolini. Hitler, and... Mussolini is the correct answer. The Orion Nebula is a region where what are forming? Stars. Stars is a correct answer. Name Frank A. Bear's best-selling 1965 science fiction novel. Pass. Pass. Looking for Dune. In baseball, which team always bats first? The away team. The away team is correct. Alcatraz Island is located in what body of water? Pacific Ocean. That is incorrect. Looking for San Francisco Bay. What nationality was Vincent Van Gogh? Italian. Italian, incorrect. He was Dutch. What German word means very? Pass. Pass. Looking for zur would be the correct answer. What is the science of the study of planets? Of plants, I should say. The study of plants Botany. is botany. botany, correct. <laughs> what long reigning king sent the Spanish Armada to England? Not enough time. Sorry for that one. Hazard a guess. King Louis V. That is incorrect. It would have been it would have been Philip II would have been the correct answer. Okay, Central Catholic, your turn. You know the rules. Three minutes on the clock. We're going to rattle off as many questions as we can squeeze into that three minutes. Uh, your clock is up and ready to go. We'll hit the go button when I read the first question. What's the only mammal that can fly? Bat. The bat is correct. Whom did Jesus send fishing to get money for taxes? Zachariah. Uh, incorrect. Looking for Peter. What state did future President Franklin D. Roosevelt serve as governor? New York. New York is correct. And Munsden Gulf and the Chukchi Sea are arms of what ocean? Arctic Ocean. The Arctic is correct. The constellation Lyra represents the lyre played by which Greek hero? Apollo. Uh, Apollo is incorrect. It was Orpheus. Next one. Name the first direct object in the Pledge of Allegiance. The flag. Uh, that is incorrect. Looking for allegiance would have been the correct answer. What is the remainder when the sum of any two odd integers is divided by two? One. One would be incorrect. It is zero. What DC memorial is surrounded by hundreds of Japanese cherry trees? Jefferson Memorial. Jefferson Memorial is correct. Each fall, which state capital hosts the World Dairy Expo? Madison. Madison is correct. What open space in front of the of the Vatican's Basilica is shaped like an ellipse? St. Peter's Square. St. Peter's Square is correct. Name the New York Yankees all-time hits leader. Derek Jeter. Jeter is correct. 
In 1876, Peter Cooper was the presidential candidate for which cheap money party? Pass. Pass. Uh, looking for the Greenback Party would have been a correct answer. What South American archipelago was named for the natives' cooking fires? Tierra del Fuego. Tierra del Fuego is correct. What is the last of Kubler Ross's five stages of grief? Acceptance. Acceptance is correct. What type of physical quantity has both magnitude and direction? A vector. A vector quantity is correct. Fannie Mae's goal was to expand the secondary market for what type of loan? Student. Student would be incorrect. It was mortgages. Next one. In 1869, a Golden Spike completed what transportation project? The Transcontinental Railroad. That is a correct answer. In uh, Paul Revere's artistry, in which metal was his focus in his professional life? Silver. Silver is correct. What area of the body is found between the thorax and the pelvis? The thoracic. That would be incorrect. Looking for abdomen would be a correct answer. This state capital is the third smallest in population, but it is the largest city in area. Is it Juneau, Pierre, Carson City, or Tallahassee? Not enough time for the answer, sorry. Juno would have been a correct Aww. answer if we had enough time. Sorry about that. We now take a break with uh, Central Catholic up 190 to 80, but we've got more game to play. We've got our final challenge. That's going to come up right after a quick break, so make sure you stay with us. Welcome back to NBC 24's Academic Challenge. The teams have made it to the final challenge. This is a buzz-in round, and each question will stop being read once a team buzzes in. Each team will be awarded 10 points for every correctly answered question. When answered incorrectly, the opposing team gets to hear the question in its entirety and has a chance to steal. The only thing separating these teams from victory and defeat is our final challenge. Hey, welcome back everyone. I'm Norm Van Ness. Thank you very much for being with us again for tonight's academic challenge. We've got another round to play here in our game between Central Catholic and Toledo Christian. We're going to put four minutes on the clock and we'll get that clock started with this first question. What is the general name for an injury to a joint or its surrounding tissues caused by external forces moving the joint beyond its normal limits or moving it uh, Central Catholic? Sprain. A sprain or a hyperextension is a correct answer. All of these substances are safe to eat except which? Millet, curé, mullet, monkfish, or snails? Uh, Toledo Christian. Millet. Millet would be incorrect. Central Catholic a try? Uh, monkfish. Monkfish would be incorrect. Technically, it's curar would be the correct answer. So we move on to the next one. Identify both Alaska's most va valuable mineral now and its most valuable mineral a century ago, Toledo Christian. Oil. Oil and? Gold. Gold would be the correct answer. Oil and gold. Next question. Thomas Wolfe was born in North Carolina, and Tom Wolfe was born in which state directly north of North Carolina? Central Catholic. Virginia, Virginia is correct. One of Maxwell's equations states that electric current yields what type of field? Central Catholic. A magnetic. Magnetic field is the correct answer. What is the name for the line perpendicular to the directix and passing through the focus of a parabola? Uh, Central Catholic. Line of symmetry. Line of symmetry or an axis is the correct answer. Two 19th century U.S. naval officers who gained international fame in the Far East held the same rank. What was the rank held by George Dewey, uh, Central Catholic? Admiral. Admiral would be incorrect. I'll finish it for Toledo Christian. What was the rank held by George Dewey in the Philippines in 1898 and by Matthew Perry in Japan in 1854? 
Commodore. Commodore, it would be the correct answer. We move to the next question. During World War II, Congress abolished its third stanza as too bloodthirsty, so we no longer hear their blood was washed out of their foul footsteps pollution. Name the song written during the War of 1812. Uh, Central Catholic. The Star Spangled Banner. Star Spangled Banner is the correct answer. Identify the four gods of classical mythology who have had planets and chemical elements named after them. Uh, Toledo Christian. Neptune. Pluto. Venus. Mars. Uh, that would be incorrect. Central Catholic, a try. Time up on that one. It was Mercury, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto would have been the correct answer. We move to the next one. The radius of a right circular cylinder, a right circular cylinder measures three inches. Its height is one foot. What would its volume be? Central Catholic. Three pi. Uh, that would be incorrect. Toledo Christian to try. 24. 24 is incorrect. 108 pi cubic inches would be the correct answer. Both the island of Hawaii and Yellowstone National Park have fumarolles. What's a, fu a fumarole? I'm sorry, a fumarole. A fumarole would be the correct answer or a correct terminology. What is a fumarole? Uh, Central Catholic. A geyser. Uh, geyser would be incorrect. Toledo Christian. Volcano. Uh, it's volcanic, but what specifically does it do? Shoots up. Volcanic okay, activity. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We will accept that. Technically, we're looking for a hole in a volcanic area in which smoke and gas escape. So uh, we'll call that as a correct answer. Which great composer wrote music almost exclusively for the piano? Was it Hayden, Schubert, uh, Toledo Christian? Hayden. Hayden would be incorrect. Central Catholic, the list for you. Hayden, Schubert, Chopin, Vorak, or Handel? Chopin. Chopin is correct. He's the piano guy. The piano man, maybe we would say. That completes our game tonight. Central Catholic ends up victorious in this one. Toledo Christian, we congratulate you guys on a game very well played, but Central Catholic will be moving on. Hopefully, you'll be moving on and coming back next week when we start up our next academic challenge. We'll see you then. Thanks for watching Academic Challenge. Be sure to check out the schedule and more at NBC24.com and find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash academic challenge. Here's a look at some of the upcoming matches. Thanks for watching Academic Challenge.